Hey guys, I have not taken a shower, for real. Um, and I was thinking about you guys, and you guys mean so much to me. I don't know when you'll watch this video. I don't know how many people stay active in the team page. This team page is yours, so make it your own. Ooh, sorry. Um, I love you guys so much, you have no idea. For my builders, you are doing amazing, and I know some struggle. I struggle, you know? I hit Success Club the first three months of, of the year and didn't hit Success Club last month. I got one point. But you know what? Everyone is, everyone's journey is their own. It takes nine, sometimes ten no's to get a yes. That's the truth. And um, I just wanted to tell you guys, I love you guys so much. Um, I think about you guys all the time. Oh my gosh. Am I... Okay, good. Just making sure I was, I was in the right, um, I was like, am I posting this live on my personal page? I don't want to do that. Um, I love you guys so much. You, it's like I said, it takes 10 no's sometimes to get a yes. Sometimes I have people coming back to me six, seven, eight months later wanting to join. So, I mean, seriously, what I can stress to you don't get frustrated. What I can stress to you is you have to post on your personal page every day. You have to. Hey. They want, they want that's the only way um, that you're going to build trust is you have to post on your personal page if you're, <laughs> you have to post on your personal page every day, at least three times. Once about once about your workout, like you have, you don't have to do your shake every day. You don't have to be, you don't have to do your shake every day, but at least your workout, they have to know that you're doing it. Otherwise it's not going to work. Like, and I'm speaking from the heart because that's the truth. My builders who want to build this business, you have to post every day on your personal page three to five times a day, because if you're doing those personal, um, messages, um, it, it'll show up on their timeline. You know what I mean? Facebook is tricky. You have to personally message people, and then when you post on your personal page, they will see it. Otherwise, they won't see your posts. It's affinity. Facebook is smart. They know what they're doing. So if you want people to join your team and you're sending out those mm -hmm. invites, mm -hmm. I love you so much. You have no idea. I want this for you. I'll crawl, walk, tread through mud, tread through water, whatever it is. I give up on nobody. Like, I'll work with your coaches, your coaches' coaches. I'm like a great, great, great grandma. You know, we may be a small team, but we're pretty awesome, pretty loving. That's why I made the logo the way it is. It's yin and yang. We have all people, age, shape, sizes, work full-time like me. Like, I work full-time. I'm a marathoner. Like, I am busy to the max capacity. Like, I am lights out, like, 9 o'clock, one eye open, like, I struggle bus, like, seriously. <laughs> I know, I see him. I know. But I gotta tell you, I'm about to be a granny, for real. Like, in two months. Like, less than two months. But seriously, you have to post every day, three to, three to five times a day. It doesn't have to be about Beachbody. It has to be your workout, for sure. For sure, you gotta post your workout. And post something that's, um, don't share a lot of other people's stuff. Don't share. Post your own recipes. Post your, um, post like positivity, affirmations. Post like what you're reading. It's something that, that you listened to that really sparked. You have to post on your personal page and your group. You have to do both. I know it's a lot of work, but you have to do both. Like for real. Like, I'm speaking the truth. No one's going to see you in the private group. If you're, if you're messaging people on your, uh, you know, personal messaging people, like, you know, you want them to join your team or you think we're awesome, Beach, Beachbody's awesome, it is awesome. But you have to post on your personal page too, every day, three to five times a day, at least three, like at least three. If you have to like, you know, do one in the morning, do one at lunch, and do one in the evening. You know, something that provides value. Like, say you found an awesome sale or a great recipe, share it. 
don't share other people's stuff share your own stuff like post a recipe that you created post your food what you ate like post your workout like I'm just like speaking from the heart because that's how I built like I they want to trust you you know what I mean they want to know that they can come to you like this girl's awesome I'm gonna keep following her the, you want them to crave your post there's a book I think called there out there called crave you want them to crave your post you know and I want the <laughs> yes you have to post both and I know like you have to copy and paste I know it's a lot of work I mean it's you can hold your you go to your Facebook post or your your group post you put your finger on it and it'll copy it it'll say copy edit or delete you co oh, thank you for the hearts it means so much to me like I love you guys like I cry all the time because I want this for you like we're gonna be kick-ass you know I'm serious like put your finger on your post open it up and then you'll have the option either copy edit or delete or whatever I don't know what it is I, I, but I know at least copy and edit when you press copy, you don't have to write the whole thing out. You know what I mean? And then you can like post it on your personal page. You know, or if you have a personal page and a t um a fan page. I don't really recommend opening a brand new fan page right away because you have to be really you have to be really consistent on your personal page. But don't be salesy because Facebook they've I've Shalene Johnson says they've slacked up, but like be careful. But if you you know what I mean, what I've been doing, I don't post on my personal page at all like at all anymore because I'm really trying to build my affinity on the fan page thing but I tag myself all the time you can tag yourself I tag you guys because I love you guys so much and wanted to give you guys love all the time like I'm always giving at least one shout out because recognition is important so because I love you guys you guys are doing amazing like you guys are kicking ass on your health journey like seriously like so you got to be working on you. You have to be working on you. They have to know that you're doing the product. You have to be the product of the product, for real. Like, truth. Be the product, but drink your shake, hydrate, do your workout, press play, read a book. 15 minutes. You got 15 minutes to read a book, for real. 10 pages. Seriously. Truth. So you're doing great in your... Kim, I can't even tell you, like, your group, like, I'm so... I mean... It was really awesome that you stepped out of your comfort zone, like making those videos and stuff like that. It's it's like, oh, I'm going to cry. You know, so, but seriously, I mean, if you need to come back and watch this later, because I know I can like talk a lot, but if you, but I'm speaking from the heart, you have to post in both your personal page and the group. If you want people to join you, they have to trust you because no one's going to see, because I put the group closed so that no one can see the post because people like privacy. You know, some people like privacy. I don't, I throw it all out there. Sometimes, most of the time. But anyways, so if you want to grow your team, you have to post them both. You also, when you're personally messaging, they're not going to see your post. That's why you have to post on your personal page because then they'll see it. Facebook is like the bomb. They figured it out. So, anyways, uh, and post value. Ask a question. Do you like A or B? Like, is this haircut good or this a, a or B? Or post value you know this recipe is awesome or this sale is awesome you guys get hit it up like fitness shoes or fitness clothes or um, good cookbooks good reading books something that builds positivity because no one wants to see like the ugly stuff on Facebook I scroll right by if I see something negative I'm not even looking I scroll right by I'm a scroller like if I see if I see a beautiful bright picture, like a beautiful you guys doing selfies, I am liking it, you know. But I have to see negative stuff of other people. I just I unfollow. Like I don't want to see negative things. I unfollow people, not you guys, but I'm talking about in general. Like nope, I don't want to see that. <laughs> you know, I'm like a positive person. You know, like I I just want positivity in my life. I have a lot of you know. So I'm just keeping it real. Love you guys. If you guys need anything from me, message me. Like, I work full time. You think I go to the bathroom and answer y'all's question? I do. For real. Because I want you guys to grow. I want you guys to... I want you guys to grow. For real. I want you guys to grow. So I hope this helped. You know, I know I'm kind of like... I'm a sapphire pearl gem. If I need to post what the gems are, I will. I'm not organized. You know, I'm doing the best I can. Progress, progress. Hashtag progress, not perfection. So, you know, I am learning as you're learning. I walk cross print, whatever it is. Like I said, message me. I believe in you. I love you guys so much. You have no idea. The seven day challenge. I'm really excited about that because I threw that on the fly and there's 
people that are joining and I hope this helps grow. If you're in the seven day challenge, make sure that you're building relationship stat. You know, talk to them, you know, just, you know, pump it up. Oh, you're welcome. I'm glad. I'm so glad it helped. Like, I know we don't do team calls because I know you guys are like super busy because I DFG has amazing calls and I share them, you know, bombshell has amazing calls and I share them. If I see something on YouTube that sparks my eye, like I shared something about Instagram, it was amazing and I shared it. So get good at something, then move to another platform and add it in. Don't do like YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, uh, Pinterest. Don't like bog yourself down. Pick one platform, then move on to the other and add it in. Like right now, my fan page is my thing and my Instagram. I'm slowly learning Instagram. You know, I've gotten a couple of coaches from Instagram, like two or three, but my fan page is like my main thing, but I'm, I'm trying to add in, oh, I'm trying to add in Instagram. So pick one thing. You don't have to be perfect. People want to see your struggle, but pick one thing, go for it, but you got to post them both. You have to be on your personal page and your group, both. You have to, so that you can build trust. They're watching. I've had so many people like, comment, I'm sorry, I'm, scratch that. I have so many people who did not like or comment on any of my stuff at all. And then they message me out of the blue, for real. So they're watching. They want to see this girl, is she going to be around like in six months? Like, is this a joke or is she for real? So keeping it truth. <laughs> okay. But... When you struggle, you have to be like, I'm loving, I'm loving this live thing. When you struggle, you have to be like, how are you going to overcome it? Like, oh my gosh, I really had like a pint of Ben and Jerry's, but I am going to kick ass in this workout. Like you have to like come up with like a game plan of how they don't want to be like all like drama posts and then they're going to keep scrolling. Man, that post was really like depressing. You know, they don't want to read that. They want to read how you're going to overcome it. You know, you can like, hey, I'm starting this challenge group, blah, blah, blah. You know, I'm really struggling. I need some help. I need some accountability. Join me. You know, keep it simple. Even in your, even in your invites, keep it simple. Kim, you know, you've been to like several Super Saturdays. Keep it simple. They don't want to read a novel in your personal message. It's like, hey, you know, make sure you do a compliment too. Compliment and then, you know, invite. Don't like just make it all about you. You want to be interested in them instead of trying to make them interested in you. Be interested in them. Make it about them, you know, in your personal posts. I mean, your in your personal messaging. Make it because you want to. I want. I want a transformation. Like I want you guys to do well. Like I really do. You know, if you're struggling health and fitness, like if you need like extra like. If you need my number, like, I can give you my number. Like, Emmy, I need you to, like, set an alarm and wake my ass up to work out. Whatever it is, you need to work on you in order for you to help others. And that's the truth. I'm always working on me every day. That's why I'm up at, like, 4 o'clock in the morning running. Because that's the only way I can have that me time where it's just me and my thoughts and listening to an audio book that is going to, like, oh, okay, my, you know, when I post those post of my things of running I'm listening like I am super pumped like when I'm done I'm like damn that was a really good audio book like audio best 15 minutes this morning I am gonna share that so if you have to set like I have three alarms on my phone to wake myself out of bed and super loud and my husband gets kind of cranky with me sometimes sometimes he sleeps through it but you got to wake up extra early sometimes. It is what it is, you know. Like, I'm training for a marathon. I work 11 hours tomorrow. I worked 11. Luckily, I had a day off today. But I work just like anybody else. But if you dream big like me, I'm a big dreamer. If you want it, like, if you want it really, whatever it is you need from me, I'm not a pushy guy. It's like, I'm not going to be like, you need to get this rank or else. I'm not that kind of coach. I'm, I'm, I'm here to support you whatever your aspirations are. Whatever it is you want to do, I'm here to support you 100%. You just have to tell me what you want from me. Like I did, I just finished the Coach, ba Coach Basics. I don't know if it helped some of you guys. I know some of you guys were in it. It was 30 days. It was kind of long, but it was back to the basics. It was awesome. There's a five-day jump start every week. I haven't shared the link in a long time because I don't even know if anybody's interested in it right now. I'll share it again this week. 
you got to be a student. You got to go into your back office. But you know what I mean? I'm not going to force you guys to do anything you don't want to do. Like, I don't want, because I love you guys so much. I'm not like, I'm, there's coaches that are like hardcore. Like, if you don't get this rank by this time, it's going to suck for me. No, I'm not like that. I'm very like, whatever it is you need for me, you let me know. For real. Whew. I don't know why I did that video. Because I love you guys. That's why. <laughs> Thank you for again, you know. I love you guys. If you have to rewatch later, whatever it is you want from me, I am here for you. And that is the truth. So, if you haven't pushed play yet, push play and post about it and tag me on your personal page. And drink your shake. And make recipes and share your own stuff. Talk to y'all soon.